Hello boys and girls, today we have a story for you to tell and the story tells us about Jesus and his disciples and how Jesus does care for us. One night Peter was walking on the shore and his friends are the disciples and he said to his friends, I'm gonna go fishing. He was actually very hungry. He wanted to get some food. He jumped into the boat and all the rest with him. And the whole night they were fishing. But nothing, absolutely nothing got into the net. It's sad, isn't it? Well, they were so tired and they tried to catch more. But nothing was happening. Fish wasn't obeying them. So they decided to go back home and clean the nets. And suddenly, in the light of rising, rising sun, they saw a man standing on the shore. And this man said, Children, do you have any food? And no, then, absolutely nothing. They said, Yeah, look, there's nothing in the net. We did work for nothing and this man said again throw your net on the right hand side do you think they obeyed or not yes yes they did so as this man said to them and they threw the net last time on the right hand side oh look at that lots of fish and all this fish wants to get into the net the net is almost breaking and they're pulling the net and they can't get it in the boat because it's so big do you think it's a miracle yes and when that miracle happened john suddenly understood who was standing there what do you think it was standing there? Jesus. You're right. It was Jesus standing on the shore. It was him who set all the fish to go into the net. Because he is the creator of all fish and all the water and everything. So he set the fish to go into the net. And while they were pulling the net, Peter jumped into the water and he swam and he swam because he wanted to get first with Jesus. He loved Jesus so much, he couldn't stand to wait. And when he came to the shore, he just suddenly saw this on the shore was fire already and it was fish ready to eat and it was bread ready to eat. Who do you think made all this lovely breakfast for them? Jesus! You're right! It was Jesus who prepared the breakfast. He didn't even use the fish that they catched because Jesus could create the breakfast from nothing. He can do it. It's a second miracle Jesus did for them. Wow! Jesus loves us and Jesus cares for us. He gives us everything what we need. He gives us food, so everyone, everyone could be happy and not hungry. And we also are his children. Jesus loves us and gives us everything what we need, isn't it? Yes. Yes, Jesus, wonderful God and wonderful Savior. And we love him very much. Thank you for watching. Bye. And and this is the craft you can make. Isn't it a happy fish? Look, it can wave with a tail like that and has a beautiful googly eye and smiles because it obeys Jesus. And it's a happy fish. You can do one. Cut the shape of the fish, ask your parents to do so and then decorate fish with anything what you can find at home pieces of paper, beads, or maybe sprinkling with some glitter or anything else. And other side of the fish you can use too. 
and use other decoration so now you can play the story of the happy fishes it was 153 of them isn't it a lot yes that's lots not even enough your hands to count wow let's do that all the best for you and see you next time bye